Hey guys, this video I'm going to talk about how to implement expire conversation in bot from a composer. Expire conversation, um, if a user does not respond a certain period of time, a bot needs to restart a conversation from the beginning. This is called expire conversation. So how to implement, we'll start. To implement this feature, I have created as a new kit package. So you no need to write all the code from the scratch instead of that you can just download this package and install it start use of this feature further first i go to the package manager but at the moment the package is not available in the package manager it will take a little bit time to publish but i provide the link to download this package manager you can download it and once you download it, go to the download folder or move to your convenient folder and run this command to install the package. So I have downloaded uh, here, uh, see uh, my folder. So I use the command new get add and this is the package bot builder community components trigger expire conversation new get package and source I will set the same path, see my feed. So the package get installed in this path. Okay, once the installation is done, go to the composer, use this option edit feed. And here you can configure your path using this add a new feed button. So if you click this button, here you have to enter the name so I provide the test package and what type of package is this uh, NuGet or NPM you have to select and the path where the uh, you know, in, uh, NuGet package is available you have to provide the path when just query is uh, leave it so once you configure and you have to change this NuGet to your uh, your local path so my local path is named test package so I click this link so if the package installed, it will display here. Okay, so click this one, install this package. Package get installed. After the go to our main dialog. So select the dialog and go to add new trigger. Click this one. So what is type of uh, this trigger? Uh, click this box and you, here you can see expire conversation bot community that is a new trigger is available click submit once it's done here you have to configure the seconds okay how long by my bot should wait so for example uh, I provide 10 seconds and I add the result also let's say dot expire once it's done you can start the conversation sorry start the bot open web chat welcome to your bot hi actually this high trigger I did not handle it here so it's default go to the unknown intent unknown intent unknown intent uh, we just uh, send the default message sorry I did not get that that's the reason I send hi I get this replay okay now we'll send next message hello so here you noticed the next message the second message I sent to bot some 24 second delay we configured as 10 second we configured expire in 10 seconds so within 10 seconds bot not received the value from the from the user so it's calculated so it's timeout here you, here you can see the time delay so expected waiting time 10 but time delay is 24 seconds so the conversation has expired and there is one more message received type message also I will show what is this so I'll print one more information
to dot activity activity restart bot open web chat restart conversation send message hi uh, I'll show this one hello so whatever activity we receive from the user if timeout happened this trigger internally changed to activity type is expire conversation so if you want to know okay what type of activity i received from the user this information is available in this field in this structure so that's what we received bot received activity type is a message so received type we put it here and same time this trigger changed to activity type is expire conversation